Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. We have the next week of ATBA. I think this is week seven, and we're fighting Lucas, his Paradise Protocol. Um, kind of nervous, kind of nervous, but I, I think we have it. Um, I have a plan. Here's his team right here, real quick. He's got Sneezer, Ting Lu, Bax Calibre, Desidue, Alamomola, Tinkaton, Crocolore, Aspartra, Aspartra, Cyclozar, and Low Kicks. Kind of nervous, but I think think our team's gonna come clutch. Um, I did a little bit of preparing, nothing too crazy, but just a little bit. Um, and I think I have a decent plan. I am a little nervous, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Let me tell him I'm ready, and then we'll get straight into it. All right, just waiting on him to uh, hit search. I'm nervous. I have a plan, but we'll see. All right, here it goes. I'm nervous. All right, all right, all right. The battle is about to start. You know what? I probably should have. Never mind. All right, so he brought pretty much what I thought he was going to break, except the Cyclozar. wasn't expecting the Cyclozar or the... Actually, you know what? No Baxcalibur? Hmm, interesting. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. No Baxcalibur. He's got the Ting Lu. He's got the Spothra. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I got a plan. So, my team, like I went through it, my team is pretty much pure damage, except for clear water and night. Oh, did I bring the wrong? I brought the wrong Palo Sand. Oh my god. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Um, the only thing I've the only thing I'm missing is um, missing the Stealth Rocks, but that's fine. Um, everyone else should be uh, perfect. That's because I made the Palo Sand last minute because I didn't have Stealth Rocks. So, anyway, sorry. We should be fine. Stealth Rocks can't... I mean, they kind of are critical, but I should be fine. Alright, alright, alright. Wish me luck. I done goofed already, but it's fine. I'm, I, uh, my Stealth Rocks, uh, this, if, the Stealth Rocks would have been so nice, but it's fine. Ting Lu lead? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Yo, this stupid Pokemon is scary. Anyways, alright, we're gonna go ahead and just chilling water. I have a plan. All right, I chilling water. Lower some throw chop. God dang! Never mind. I don't have a plan. Oh, a crit. That's so buns, bruh. That's so buns. Um, I'm in danger. All right, peep 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 peep. peep. I need to save him. Hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. So peep 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 peep. I can. This is a little risky. This is a little risky. I should have just swapped out, but that's so stupid because like I wasn't expecting a throw chop. Great. I could have lived one throw chop. Um, let me see it. I think I go into Ariana, try to bait another throw chop, and then swap into Lucario for the justified. Because I don't want to catch an EQ. Yeah, I'm going to swap into Ariana. Hopefully I can bait out a uh, Throat Chop. Okay. Hopefully I don't get EQ'd. If I get EQ'd, I'm, I will cry. I have options still, but it's fine. Hope he Throat Chops or uses Ruination. Hopefully I can bait out this uh, throw chop again, or ruination, either one. But he definitely goes throw chop, right? Yep, there we go. Sheesh, that kind of hurt. 
justified, okay. And then here goes a huge close combat. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Whatever comes in catches a huge close combat. Party Loco? Yo, what? What is this thing made out of? Bro, what the heck? What is this thing made out of? What the heck, bro? I built this Lucario, right? Right? Max attack? Yeah. This thing is tanky. What the heck? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Interesting. Interesting. <clears throat> Lucario can't stay in. I do have the plus one, but he can't stay in because I need him. I, I think I go into nine. Put him to sleep. And then swap out. I think that's the plan. Man, Palo Sand was... That was so critical. I don't think Palo Sand would have died if it wasn't a crit. The Stealth Rocks didn't even matter because... uh Slack off to heal. That's fine. I'm going to go ahead and yawn this thing. Oh, this is a... Uh, this is his Torkoal. Um, this is his Torkoal. That's funny. I just thought about that. That's fine. The withdrawal is fine because whatever comes in gets... Uh, Gets yawned. Gotta go fast. Okay, okay. This thing can get put to sleep, right? There's no way it doesn't. Cyclizar. Like normal, the ability is shed skin and regenerator. Oh, it's got shed skin. 33% chance of curing any major status ailment after one turn. Okay, that's fine. Um. Let's send out. <clears throat> I think, honestly, I kind of want to swap into Ariana. And then go ahead and Dazzling Gleam. Let me make sure. Let me see if the Cyclozar is physical or special. It's physical. I still can go into Ariana. But honestly, Toyo is right there. I could go into Luka. But it's kind of risky because Luka's already kind of low health. I'm going to go into Toyo. I get the free swap and Toyo can apply some good pressure. I don't want to um, go into Luka and then risk taking damage and then have to close combat again and so on and so forth. So. Got my Quark Drive up. My booster energy. The attack. Oh, is this one adamant? That's fine. This one's adamant? I thought it was Jolly. It's fine. The U-turn is fine. Got the free swap in. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't want Lucario to uh, eat that U-turn. I'm scared of that Espathra, to be honest. <clears throat> but I know he's probably saving it last. Okay. Then I'm probably getting throat chopped here. Um, or EQ'd. This one's a little tough, um, I think. I think I have a plan. Yeah, I got a plan. <clears throat> this is gonna be rough. But I think I'm gonna go into I'm gonna go into Torgo. I'm gonna go ahead and yawn. I just I don't want to catch throw chop from. I did have the plus one, but yeah, here comes the EQ. Um, no, hold on, I'm dumb because the sun was still out. I thought I had a plan. I was gonna put him to sleep. That's fine. Do I live a throw chop? Do I live a throw chop? Let me run some calcs. Let 
Let me see if I run, if I live a throat chop. I doubt, big doubt. How much time is left? It doesn't even tell me. All right, cool. 30 seconds, all right, I got time. And then this thing is, this thing has throat chop. Let's throw chop kill. Throw chop does not kill. Shouldn't kill. Alright. So I think I go Patronus. Throw chop doesn't kill. Uh, uh, so, okay, so he could go throw chop. He could go ruination. Um, I think I can get off a sword, one singular sword stance. Um, he's probably going to swap because he doesn't want to stay in. I mean, if he doesn't, then I Swords Dance and then Seed Bomb. But, um, I think I Swords Dance. And then, uh, regardless of who he brings out, I can just Body Slam them. Because if he does swap out, he'll probably swap into a Croc. I'm going to go ahead and Swords Dance. I need that pressure. Yep, free swap out. He's going to go into the Crocodile. Because he's thinking I'm going to go... Yep. And I kind of really, really, really want to, um... And then the sun goes away. Yep. I really want to just body slam. Let me see. Let me run these calcs real quick. Um, and your defensive. And then I got my sauce bug. Give it the plus two sword stance. And then we're going to go body slam. Where is the body slam? Only does 30? Okay, but that's not without Swords Dance. Let me add the Swords Dance. I'm running out of time. Um, I think I Body Slam. I think I Body Slam for sure. Don't second guess myself. I should still do enough damage. He might predict to swap out. No, I didn't do any damage, but Body Slam? Uh, sorry, Paralyzed? Nope. And then Flamethrower, and then I lose Patronus. I don't lose Patronus. Interesting. Alright, here, here, here goes. Look. Check this out. Check this out. I was hoping that the body sign was going to para, but no, it's fine. And then Ariana can tank a pretty good bit. Here comes another flamethrower. No, a slack off. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to Shadow Ball because I have a feeling the Ting Lu is going to come back out. And I can just Dazzling Gleam the Ting Lu. I'm going to go ahead and Shadow Ball. Oh, okay. No swap out. Because this thing's tanky. The Yawn. Okay. I do have to swap out for sure. Um, do I swap out or do I just... Do I swap out? Do I swap out? Do I just let Ariana fall asleep? I don't want to let Ariana fall asleep, but it, if I send out any of these three, they get flamethrower to death. Okay, honestly, I think I let... I think I let Saucebook drop, sack off Saucebook because I can't let Ariana drop because I need her. But then I also need Toyo and Mentalist. I think I let Saucebook drop to the flamethrower because I need Ariana. When I come back out, I think I'm just going to Psychic. Even if he gets a free swap into Ting Lu, I think that's still fine. Okay, with the withdraw. Okay, okay. End of days. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to go for a huge Seed Bomb. It's not going to do that much damage because I'm not Swords Dance, but I think I still go Seed Bomb. I don't think I go Swords Dance. Regardless of what he does, I think we're fine. 
withdraw back into the the stupid uh lethal dose. Oh, the sneezler. Okay, that's fine. That did some decent damage. All right, now the thing is. Oh yeah, I'm life orb. I'm dumb. All right, that's fine. So, I think what we do now. I think we go into Toyo. We terrestrialize and then we just mash Earthquake. Now that we have a free, like, fresh swap in. I need to save uh, Luca and Ariana. The Sucker Punch is coming, right? So I just... I think I live a Sucker Punch. If he has a Sucker Punch on there. I think I live one. I don't want to risk not terrestrializing because then I'll catch a close combat which is scarier. So I'd rather catch a, yeah, I'd, I'd rather catch a sucker punch. He's gonna withdraw maybe. Oh, a U-turn. Okay, that's fine. That's still fine. Whatever comes out is going to catch an EQ. I don't think he has anything that can... Uh, yeah, I don't think he has anything that can uh, tank this. I did no damage. Alright, and then I know the throw trap's coming for sure. I'm hoping if I swap into Lucario... I really want to swap into Lucario, but that was some decent damage it did with the throw chop. And then I can also risk getting EQ'd. I think I think what I do, I think I earthquake. I think I earthquake. Get the extra damage off. Instead of risking swapping into Lucario. And then once Toyo goes down, I go into Ariana. Dazzling Gleam to finish it off, or if he swaps out, I can still do decent damage towards everything else. But I need to save Lucario, I feel like. Lucario is here for this, but if I swap out right now, Lucario is pretty low, so I don't think it's worth. I'm gonna Earthquake. He might think I'm swapping out, so he might not throw a chop again, because he doesn't want the Justified Luka. Okay, that was some good damage. Yeah, EQ, see? Yep, perfect. Yep, and we lived it, let's go. Alright, and then we go with another Earthquake. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And then the EQ, yeah, good thing, good thing I, yeah. I've been saying Ariana too much. Good thing I just swapped into uh, Ariana. Or sorry, uh, to Lucario, because then I would have caught the uh, Earthquake. Good thing, alright. I could go into Luca, but I know for a fact he's probably going to swap to uh, that stupid, uh, what's it called? Into, uh, what is that thing called? So the stupid, uh, Thingy, the uh, cro crocodile. So I think I can go into Ariana. Think I can. Let me go ahead and check the speed right quick. 299 and then 279. So definitely faster. I think I go into Ariana. Hit the dazzling gleam. And then no, because the minus special defense. But then see, I can't send out him because I need him for the rest of everything. To be honest. Hmm. I go into Ariana. It's low. I'm hoping a Dazzling Gleam kills. Dazzling Gleam better kill. Look at how low it is. Dazzling Gleam better kill. <clears throat> Even if, maybe if it's AV, but I don't. Is it? Hmm? I don't know. Dazzling Gleam better kill. Oh, you withdrew it. You suck. Let me get the kill and then the Sneasler, no. Interesting because the Dazzling Gleam is definitely going to do a lot of damage. Okay. What does he have for this knockoff or something? Let me check. Mo what moves does this thing get? Like, why? Probably knockoff? Probably because it outspeeds. 
I bet you that's why. I bet you that's why. Cyclozar definitely outspeeds. Um, Dragon moves. Doesn't look like. Does get bite. Maybe knockoff. All right. You know what? I go dazzling gleam again. Cause if I swap out, I mean either way, I'm taking a hit. So I think I go dazzling gleam for sure. Lucario's in no position to be swapped into. So overheat. Okay. Well, good thing I didn't swap into freaking. Uh, let's go. Good thing I didn't swap into. Uh, what's it called? Good thing I just swap it to the Lucario. God dang. And then I Dazzling Gleam again. The U-turn, that's gonna... That's huge, but it's fine. I should have Psychic because this Neasler's coming out. I should have Psychic. It was already low. I might as well should have... I should have just Psychic. Nova Cane. That's the uh, Sparthra. Okay, that's fine. Oh, huge damage. What, what is that? Citrus? No. Lefties. That's going to set up on me. Um, I'm going to go ahead and Shadow Ball. I'm pretty sure I would speed this right now. Or live one hit. Protect for the speed boost. That's fine. That's fine. Not too worried because even if it sets up, I think I should be fine with an E speed from the Luka. As long as I get another hit off, I should be fine. It's probably going to call mine right here. Does it outspeed me? It probably does outspeed me, but I think I can hold one hit. I think I can live one hit. <clears throat> call mine. Should be able to live one hit. Eventually, but uh, right now, this should do good damage. I need to chip it down just in case Lucario comes back. Oh, let's freaking go, Meloetta. And the special defense drop. Let's go. Let's freaking go. So it's plus one special attack, right? Plus one special attack, plus two speed. So I should be able to hold one hit. I don't think it learns anything special effective on me. Yeah, the withdraw. Okay, whatever comes out catches a huge, huge, huge shadow ball. Got a f oh no, it doesn't. It's gonna U turn again. I should have just psychic. This thing out speeds. Do I live another one? I'm at 164. <sighs> Let me see. I don't know if I live another one. Cyclozar, let's go offensive and then go U-turn. U-turn. Against my Meloetta. Alright. U-turn does about half. I'm already about half. <clears throat> Lucario is in no position to be swapped into. But it, it does, I mean, is he going to overheat again? I'd rather risk it, right? I'd rather risk it. Alright, let's go Psychic. A knockoff. Oh, that killed. I should have just gotten it to Lucario, but it's fine. I was I was hoping uh I didn't I thought he was gonna overheat predicting a Lucario swap. It's fine. Do I kill with an E speed is the problem. Do I kill with an E speed? Because he can just overheat turn one and kill me. So I'm going to have to E speed. Uh, Luca. Luca Swords Dance. Um, does an E speed kill the Cyclozar? E speed does 51 to 60. Hell yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless I get a super, super low roll and he's tanky. No, he didn't kill. What? Bro. Wow, that's dumb. That's so dumb. Hey, at least I left all his mons low. That's so dumb. That was a that was an extremely low roll because that was an E speed Luca does 51 to 60 percent. That's crazy.
GG's. GG's. That was a good match. Man, I should have swapped into the Lucario first, but like he could have just overheated that time. Well, GG's, Lucas, and then next week, I'm, I better come out with some kind of dub. That's crazy. We appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next week.